Hi everyone, welcome to the Plant Life Podcast. My name is Dana, and thanks for checking out this episode. You may already be familiar with carrier oils, and many of the common ones, like coconut, sweet almond, or apricot kernel. But today we are talking about a carrier oil that isn't quite as popular, but has just as many benefits and uses. That carrier oil is black currant seed oil. Want to know more about it? Keep on listening. Black currant is a shrub that is known for growing dark black colored berries. Native to Europe and Northern Asia, this plant has been known throughout history for a variety of uses. The fruit produced from the shrub can be eaten raw, but is commonly used to make jams, jellies, syrups, and juices. Mostly popular in Europe, black currants used to be grown in the US as well, but were banned due to being a prime agent for a fungus that was detrimental to pine trees, thus affecting the American logging industry. Growing black currant plants were banned, and while federally the ban has been lifted, statewide, growing this plant is still illegal. However, some states have lifted that ban, the most recent being New York in 2003. Black currant seed oil is cold pressed from the seed of the black currant fruit. This process does not use solvents in its extraction, so the pure oil is free from chemicals. The seed oil is different than the black currant absolute, which many people get confused. Black currant seed oil does not have a strong aromatic smell, smelling more like a nutty oil. It is also a carrier oil, which can be applied topically without dilution. The black currant absolute is a solvent extracted essential oil that comes from the flower buds and is meant for perfumery use. It should not be applied topically without dilution. Traditional medicine has used black currants to treat inflamed sore throats and fevers or illnesses related to fevers using the raw juice and also boiling the juice into an extract with sugar. Black currants have been used for generations for its high content of vitamin C, especially when other fruits like oranges were difficult to obtain. Vitamin C is excellent for the skin as the body uses it to form collagen, which may contribute to anti-aging. Black currant seed oil has a high content of alpha linoleic acid, or omega-3, and gamma linoleic acid, or omega-6. The omegas in this oil have been shown to be anti-inflammatory for the body, and may help with joint or muscle stiffness or soreness, as well as dry skin issues. Because of its dense fatty acid and vitamin C profile, black currant is great for the skin to help nourish, soothe, and protect. It is good for damaged skin types or mature skin types, and this oil absorbs quickly, penetrating into the skin for hydration. Another reason black currant seed oil is great for the skin is that it contains compounds called anthocyanins, which are flavonoids that have antioxidant effects. This compound is also responsible for black currant's rich black color. Because of this compound's antioxidant effects, black currant may help protect the skin against free radical damage that can contribute to signs of aging. You can use black currant seed oil on the hair as well, and it is great for hair types that are damaged or dry. When applied, this oil leaves hair looking nourished and healthy. Now that you know a bit more about this amazing oil, how do you use it? You can use this oil to dilute essential oils to apply them topically. However, we have a few great tips and recipes for harnessing the incredible properties of black currant seed oil. For hair, black currant seed oil is said to be good for preventing hair loss and for dry scalp issues. You can apply this oil directly to the scalp, massage it in, and let sit for 30 minutes then rinse thoroughly. You can also apply it to your hair in the same manner for a hair oil treatment. Try combining it with other oils that are great for hair like lavender, peppermint, rosemary, or lemongrass. Because of its nutrient profile, black currant seed oil is great for repairing the skin after damage, like excess sun exposure. It is excellent for dry skin as well. This oil makes a great oil for the face because of its antioxidants and vitamin C. You can apply it directly as a moisturizer and it will absorb quickly into the skin, or make your own face serum. Combine 2 ounces of black currant seed oil with 5 drops lavender, 5 drops geranium, 3 drops of bergamot, and 2 drops tea tree. This recipe is great for normal or maturing skin types. If you prefer less floral aroma, substitute the essential oils with just 10 drops of frankincense, which has a rich, earthy smell, but still has great benefits for the skin. Another way to treat yourself is a relaxing face mask. Face masks are an easy way to take care of your skin. 
There are so many different combinations you can try out depending on your skin type, but here are a few ideas to get you started, all using blackcurrant seed oil. For normal to oily skin, face masks with clay can be great. Combine two to three teaspoons of clay, like bentonite clay, and enough blackcurrant seed oil to make a paste should be about one or two teaspoons. Add essential oils that are good for the face like carrot seed oil for its antioxidants, lavender for soothing and calming, or tea tree for acne. Depending on your skin and the essential oil, add about 5 to 20 drops of essential oil. You can also add some activated black charcoal to detox. For drier maturing skin types, avoid the clay and go for more moisturizing ingredients. Try combining 2 to 3 teaspoons of black currant seed oil with 1 teaspoon honey and 2 teaspoons of softened oatmeal. Essential oils like geranium, lavender, and carrot seed are great for dry skin. Other ideas for a moisturizing face mask you can try are half an avocado or a banana. Plant Life's black currant seed oil is 100% pure, with no additives, and is cold pressed and GMO free. Our black currant seed oil is also available in 10 ml and 2 ounce sizes. If you'd like to try out this amazing oil, visit us at www.plantlife.net and try it out today. If you use black currant seed oil and have a great way to use it, let us know what you do by leaving us a comment. If you want more things Plant Life, join us on our social media channels at Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and Pinterest. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>